Hey guys, Ty Bone Skyberg here. Today's action figure review is Power Rangers Lightning Collection with Finster from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers 6 inch action figure from Hasbro, but it's only at Amazon exclusive. All right, so what can I say, Finster? He was my favorite with this figure right here, and I've been waiting to get it on my hands on it with this guy right here. And in case you know Finster or not, he was the, the villain of the Rita Repulsa and Lord Zed. You get on my point like this, and he is a, the maker of the, he can make those monsters and henchmen, uh, like party patrols and summon any others. But that's the only, uh, Rita Repulsa's monsters, the, the maker, for example, like, uh, the clay, plastic, or whatever you call it, like this. Um, just like in the Mighty Morphin Season 1, and then you can, the, what this, the whole thing and accessories. I'll talk about the takeout of the package later after this. But not only in season one, how about season two and three from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers and of course the Alien Rangers and, and of course Power Rangers Zeo and the ways that it's out there. He, he was very amazing in my opinion. And of course, not only uh, Lloyd Zed has the voice that, that the actor is Robert Axelrod, and he was also the voice of, of Finster, so, because I didn't know this until now, so, he has both voices of, uh, with Lloyd Zed, and of course, Finster was at the beginning, so, which I didn't know this, and at the time, that was, so, and you can see right here, it looks very amazing, so, and I picked this up at this figure right here from Amazon. It costs like uh, $27, like 27 and a half. Well, you got to pay like taxes until $30 or something reason. So, so it's only an Amazon exclusive. If you get that this guy right here or not, let me know if you guys picked up this up. It looks very amazing. So what I'm going to do, let's get on to that. All right, you can see that, that the package looks nice. The same as usual like this and that the, the figure and his accessories inside. I'm talking about it in any second. And you can see it says Power Rangers Lightning Collection. It says Mighty Morphin Fitster. Well, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, obviously. Hasbro logo and there's uh, the artwork, the, the drawing design looks and at the front and you can see right here it looks very amazing and like this it's like a 3d package like i said and it says mighty more of a look around it like this for example and look like this uh, you get my point like that it looks very amazing and of course on the left uh, the same as usual like this on the, on the right in the middle the, on the front you get my point and not much in the sun on the top it is called blue and of course there's some information underneath and of course on the behind, it says when he's holding an accessories and then whatever he's holding at this. It looks very amazing. No other, other previously figures. It's just like in a, the, the olive ones, like regulars or whatever. It's not like that. And of course, and there's an information. It says Hasbro on it. And it looks very amazing. So, all right, let's get this open at this figure right here. And let's find out, you guys. All right, so here's Finster's six inch action figure out of the packaging. And you can see right here, it looks very amazing and it looks very uh, decent and it looks very great in my opinion. And you, what do you think guys? And you can see right here, it looks very amazing. So, and I tried to take out all the accessories and that the figure himself, it looks very amazing that you get my point like that. It looks very amazing. So, what I'm gonna do, let's get into that. But first, let's talk about the accessories before I'll show you into the figure. And it looks very amazing. I, I can tell you why it might be. And so, let's get onto that in accessories. So, all right, let's talk about like, the hands right here. Um, let me try to figure it out. I was trying to focus on right here. All right, it says one foot of the, uh, on the, the left hand like this. And of course, one for, uh, the opening, and I forgot that this one, I think it's a fist, uh, I'm not sure because it's, it's opening, same thing as this, this one, I'm not sure if it is because of that, but on the right, it's okay, it has both opens, and it looks very amazing, and so far I can tell that, because it has articulated, uh, this one right here, but like I said, I'm not gonna changeable, like I said, from my other previously videos, the, the peg joints for the wrist, and uh, you can see the hands right here, so very important that you guys, so anyway, like I said, it looks very amazing with that. 
Uh, I don't understand. Why did they put like this one on? Maybe it's the bones uh, that on his hands on it. I'm not sure why. It's because of that one. It's the same thing. I don't know. Anyway, maybe it's just the TV show. I don't know. That's just me on it. All right, let's talk about the the knife thing or whatever you call it, like uh, the little tiny thing. Uh, let me try to figure it out. It's a, it's hard to tell, but it looks like a, a very amazing with this knife, or the the knife thing for the the plastic uh, plate off or something like Fister did. It looks very great. Uh, Mimi put a little bit this piece right here. It looks exactly it looks like this. It's a little tiny thing what he was holding it at that thing. So anyway, that's just me on it. It looks great. This is great. Now you talk about this one. This one here is the big one. That is a pure, look at this. It looks very nice. I like the, the server chrome knife thing for the curls. It looks nice. And you can see right here. Uh, yeah, you can see right here. It looks nice. I'll put it at the rest of them. And at the end of the video, the when he's holding it like this, when I look at it. And so, yeah. And then, then the other one was this one right here. I forgot it's his name was, I forgot what his name is this one. But this one here, you have to use like a smasher or something when Finster is making it. The monster, it looks very great. And you can see right here, it looks nice. And whatever is out there. So, now this one right here, it looks exactly, I think it was that the glasses when he put, what he put it on at the, the necklace on it and uh, what it has, uh, the goggles on it. You can see when Finster is looking at it, he has on the glasses over there. Uh, so this was, looks great in my opinion. It looks very detailing and it, you can see right here, it looks nice. That comes part when the necklace part of it and you can see right here, it looks nice. And uh, there is a, a little bit, this piece is the Party Patrol maker with, uh, when Finsters make. And for example, one for the the same identical, the Party Patrollers makers, just like the, the TV show added. It looks very great. One for the, the saber and one for the ball. Uh, I could tell you it looks great. Now, let's talk, let's talk about the case on it if you wanted to put does the put a, a part of it yeah it does it does made me put like this one right here this case right here it looks very great in my opinion except this one i tried to figure it out to take them out but it's just stayed the way it was so but the rest of them the other two it's okay you can use like this it has pieces, uh, looks great. This is, is the, the suitcase. I don't know. Maybe it's just a suitcase. If you want to close it, um, that's close it. Yeah. That's how it is. And if you want to open, whoops, sorry about that. Anyway, that's just how, that's just how to figure it out like that. So don't worry about it. It's all cool. It, it looks nice though. Don't get me wrong. I like this. So, all right, let's talk about the Finster himself, the figure. All right, so you can see right here that it looks nice, and uh, you can see right here. And what do you think, guys? It looks very great. And let me put it a little bit, this piece right here. So anyway, uh, this is much better. Let me try to figure it out. This, yeah, you can see, you can see right here. It looks. Look at this. It looks nice, in my opinion. And uh, you can see right here. It looks nice, and I like the design. They will look like. I think nail it. Hasbro nail it with this thing. It kind of reminds me of the other rest of the figures like Goldar, Lord Zed, and Rita Reposa. This one here, it's a little bit different. Kind of reminds me on it, the, the articulation. I'll talk about that later. And you can see it looks nice. And yeah, comments below. Let me know what do you guys think. It looks very, this is a very a decent figure. And you can see, this one's a glasses. Then I mentioned it, that one because... Like that. Does take him off? I'm not sure. Oh, maybe because this is a rubber. So, but when he's putting on it, and nose on it. And, of course, you got right here. It looks nice. Now, you can see, you know, the rest of the figure. It looks nice. Of the rest of them, it's fine. And then you can see, it you know, on the back. And then you can see right here. It looks nice. Uh, the figure is nice, though, because it has the same body from, comes from the Hasbro on it. All right, let's talk about the articulation. And you can see it has 360. It looks very simple, easy. 
and it has Nick Pippet, and that uh, he has like this. Uh, it looks great. So, but he cannot up because this is something like this. So, but he has goes down, but he goes up like that normally. Before I was trying to the rest of them, guess what? It has mouthpiece articulated. Okay, it looks cool though. Same thing. They would look like a uh, Tanga or Tango Warriors has mouthpiece. Uh, it looks great though. It has talking so. This just looks great in my opinion. All right, it has a, a bubble fly joint like this. Has this one? This is not the same as like a Power Rangers, for example. But this one's just different one a little bit. This piece. All right, so he has a, a shoulder joint like this, and you can see. Oh, oh yeah, he has a, a little bit of the different ones. Okay, I was wrong a little bit. I thought I was no, a little bit normally or something like that. All right, so he has an arm joint like this, like a shoulder joint, a little bit this piece. It has, this is new. All right, I, I didn't know this. All right, it has uh, the elbow joint. It looks very great. It's okay. And you can see right here the wrist. But he has uh, a little bit this piece because it has, uh, if you want to change that bit because you can. Or otherwise, keep it in mind that one. Now, let's talk about the app crunch. It's not the same as the, the, the regular one, like uh, the up and down thing, but it has a little bit difference like this, because this is like this. For example, it kind of reminds me like Ghostbusters, for example, because this is an app crunch like this. Uh, I believe Hasbro owns Ghostbusters now, call it Plasma Series or whatever you call it was. Because this is the amp crunch looks like. Yeah, it's it's kind of reminds me of the same one like that. It, it looks okay in my opinion. It looks all right. Like I said, it looks very great. It looks like this, and it doesn't have an up or down recently. Yeah, this one's right here. All right, so let's talk about. I was trying to figure it out. It looks it has uh, the articulation at that one right here. This one has kick forward that he does not kick back on it because it's the same one like this. All right, let, let's talk about this one right here. Does he have a, a leg joint? Oh, uh, because, uh, yeah, this one, leg joint like this, like this, and in a knee articulation, and it's new. Uh, I didn't see that this coming, and now now let's talk about, oh, this this one's talking about the, the feet joint like this. Oh, this is new. Uh, oh, it's because of the, the boot joint. I don't know, just like the rest of the Power Rangers figures. Now that he has uh, the the ankle up and down like this, like I said, generally, and he has an uh, ankle pivot. So, and yeah, that's all there is to that, and that's pretty much it. And uh, this was looks very amazing with this figure, in my opinion. And yeah, there's not much else to say about that. It looks very amazing. So, all right, let's go to the, the comparison for you guys. So, final thoughts. I really like this figure a lot. It looks very amazing. And so far as I could tell that, I want to put like that. I don't have it a mini table to put like that. But I want to use like that to put a whole thing like this, just like the TV show or the promo images looks like. Yeah, it looks exactly. A, this this one's very amazing, guys. So, you can see right here, it looks very amazing. Yeah, that's Finster for you. 
uh, just like the, the Mighty Morphin Season 1, it looks very great with this. And this figure right here, it looks very decent, it looks very nice, and you can see it right here, the rest of them, it looks very amazing. So, any issues about the, the, the figure? No, of course not. Except the, the necklace part, I try not to put holding like that. It's because it's a soft rubber. But you got to put um, the neck part, you got to open very gently when you put it on like that. It looks it looks okay. Not to any problems. The neck joints or something like that, you have to be very careful. Open gently, but it's it's very easy, but you have to open gently. But now the, the, the minifigure, the party patrol on it, the plastic ones, it, you can go through in, but sometimes the, these two hands are very hard, like you can't go in. That's any of the only issues about like that. But the, the rest of them, it's fine, no problems with the articulation. It's gonna be the same mounts like Hasbro. And even the ab joints, uh, like I said before, they would look like a uh, Ghostbusters, for example. That's, the, the same one reminds me on it. Not that the same ones like at the rest of them, like Power Rangers, the double joints like that. But the ab crunch right here a little bit, it's a, not the same as like a square one a little bit. It's different one like that. Just like a, just like a Ghostbusters, like I said, it's a little bit like difference like here. And the rest of the joints, it looks fine, no problems. Like I said, it looks very, this figure is looks very, a decent figure, in my opinion, it looks very great. And my final readings with Power Rangers Lightning Collection with Finster from the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers 6 inch action figure from Hasbro, but is only at Amazon exclusive. I want to give it a, this figure right here, a 10 and a 10 because this figure and in accessories, it looks very amazing. It's very good, decent in my opinion. There's, I have no words on it. It looks very great in my opinion. It looks very amazing. So I'm going to give it a, this figure right here, a 10 and a 10. All right, stay tuned for more figures coming up and we'll see. Don't forget click like, comments below, don't forget subscribe and check it at the icon bell, no notifications in case you missed it or not. This is Tybone Skyberg. I'll see you around guys. Happy toy hunting and happy action figure hunt and take care.